All right. So why don't you tell us who you are, how long you've been CrossFitting, and what your athletic background is. Um, and and who that gentleman is behind you. Oh, That's my bud, Bob. Uh, my name is Drew Barquist. Um, I've been CrossFitting for about four years now. Um, my athletic background, I wrestled for four years in high school. And for two of those years, I was doing CrossFit. And ever since, I've been doing CrossFit and pursuing Olympic lift, weightlifting and powerlifting as well. And you're in school now, right? Yep. I go to the UW for a majoring in physiology. Very nice. So why why do you like training people? Why do you want to continue being a trainer and helping people out? It's really cool to see people progress. Um, people do things that they can't thought they never could do, like handstand push-ups or something like that. Some people, people that when they come from a point where they're not healthy and they don't think they're strong enough to ever do anything, and they get to a point where they can do stuff they would never thought they could. So that's it. Why and why Linwood CrossFit? I'm sure you've kind of bounced around other boxes and gyms. It's the best gym I've ever been to. Why is that? Coolest people, great, great uh, atmosphere, best trainers, best equipment. There's nothing, no other reason to go anywhere else. And um, what's your favorite workout or movement? I think that would have to be Grace. Would be my favorite because I'm good at it. <laughs> Uh, favorite movement, either clean and jerk or snatch, because I like Olympic lifting. Yeah. What do you hate seeing up there? <sighs> Running. Or burpees. So like 800 meter repeats wouldn't be your favorite? That's dirty. <laughs> Don't say that. <laughs> and, um, going to school for physiology and being really involved in CrossFit for a long time, what diet have you adopted or do you believe in? Uh, paleo. Uh, Pretty much paleo. Like there's there's nuance to all of it. Not really just not zealot about it. There's but there's a lot of good things to be gained from it. And you're the gentleman that uh, heats his food in the microwave in here and <laughs> tends. Hey, it's to... delicious. <laughs> you like organ meats and all that great stuff. Wonderful. And if you had to choose, it, like you were gonna die tomorrow, your your cheat meal that you would have. Oh. Probably go to the Cheesecake Factory. Cheesecake would be, like, my favorite thing that I've missed out on. Ice cream. Um, my mom's strawberry rhubarb pie. She makes amazing pie. <laughs> uh, that's completely terrible. And just, like, all sorts of goodness. I don't know. Awesome. Those are a few things. Well, thank you very much.